Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. This video, I'm gonna talk a little bit about camera movement and axisymmetry. So you can set up a lot of really nice camera movements within axisymmetry. For example, here, I have a few paths that I've set up. And this is a very basic camera movement from point A to point B. But if you guys were to add some roll to your camera movement, you could get some more interesting shots like this or like this or like this and like this. So the first thing that you need to do is to actually enable camera roll because it is disabled by default. To enable it, all you have to do is go on the file tab, go to properties and go in the scene editing and here, there is a box that you can tick. It says allow roll. So once that's done, you can apply and hit OK. All right, so now I'm gonna set up a new shot here under cam number two, and I'm gonna use path number five. And I'm gonna select point A here to get into edit mode. And in my preview one here, I'm gonna hold the Alt key on my keyboard and my middle mouse button. And I'm gonna rotate the shot a little bit to the right. And then I'm gonna select point B and I'm gonna track out away from the car. So this is gonna be a track out shot. And I'm gonna again hold Alt on my keyboard and my middle mouse button. And I'm gonna rotate it a little bit to the left. And now I can test my animation. For those of you who are just getting started in Eximetry and still haven't figured out all the like camera controls and all that, I just want to let you guys know that there is a very complete documentation at the Eximetry website. I will leave a link in the description and you guys should totally check it out because it's really complete, it's really informative and you should find anything that you need right there. And that's it for me. I hope it was useful and I'll see you guys in the next video.